Julia, I'm Courtney and today I'm going to do a hair tutorial of how to do a curly do here with a um, fascinator and then at the back I'm going to do two um, victory rolls and I'll show you how you do that. Um, so first of all, my curling tongs are on to do the front bit but what I'm going to do is I'm just going to section that off before I do anything. Um, so I'm just going to tie that up because I don't need that right now. Okay. <laughs> right. And then all I'm going to do is I'm going to take my comb and I'm going to part and like section it like completely in half. And I'm just going to um, get another hair bun. Okay. So I'm going to section it off and I'm going to show you um, how I do the back. I'm going to do it from two views, so I'm going to do it um, front on and then I'll show you with the other side how to do it on the back. So all I'm going to do is comb my hair and take it like I would, you can have it over or behind your ear, I like it behind because I don't like things touching my ear. So take it like you would to tie a ponytail like this, okay, and then with the bot like with the other hand, just grab the back like the bottom of the hair and just wrap it round one finger. So when you've done that, pin it, and you want. You want it secure, so three or four bobby pins each side. And if a bit comes out, just either tuck it in or grip it. Because obviously my hair, it depends on how long your hair is. But my hair is all different lengths at the back. So just... Okay, like that. And then with this side, I'm going to show you how to do it from the back. So just bear with me and we'll see... There we go. Um, okay. Yeah, okay. So I'm just going to do exactly the same, comb it. So that's the back victory rolls, and all I'm going to do is I'm just going to spray it with my hairspray. Okay, and then I'm going to take this bit and where's my comb? I'll use my hairbrush. So I'm going to just do random curls in this section um, just it's always nice when the curling tools don't want to work
And this bit's up to you if you want to curl your hair or whatever. You could do a booth one at the front or a quiff or anything really. Um, I'm only, I only do the curl because I think it looks quite nice. Um, but you can do all sorts of things like with the back victory rolls. Or you could start them from the whole of your head if that makes sense. So you could brush this back and just separate a whole lot, like, parting all the way down and then just do it from the back. Turn them off. All I'm going to do is just run my fingers through them, and then all I'm going to do is just at the bottom, just pick it up. So just literally take and pick, and just plonk it on your head, and leave a bit. If like I always leave a bit um, down, and then just pin that. Because you've got to be wearing, a, like I'm wearing, I'm going to be putting a fascinator in, so you don't want it too, too neat, but you want it quite, like, don't want it too sticking out, if that makes sense, because you want, like, more people to look at the back of your hair and the fascinator than the random swirly curls. Okay. So all I'm going to do with the top bit is I'm just, I've just got one roll here and I'm just going to bring it round a bit just to make it look different. And I'm just going to pin all the way through that if that makes sense, so like that. And then I've got one strand and I'm going to turn my curling tongs back on just to curl that. And while I'm doing that, I'm just going to put the fascinator in, just about there. Come on, curling tongs. I've jinxed these curling tongs. I, used, I said in another video that they were really good, and now um, they don't actually want to work. <laughs> you want like a few curls and flicks. And then I'm just going to quickly respray the hair. And that is my curly do with a fascinator and two back victory rolls.